what is up my murderer square enix has done it again stranger of paradise final fantasy origin is an absolute masterpiece within its own right though not without its own flaws combat animation does not feel quite as fluid as the 7 remake or recent releases like Elden Ring, it throws us off slightly that the running slash jogging animation is not quite lined up with the distance covered, for example. Aside from its apparent depth perception issues, it more than makes up for it in terms of some amazing visuals and storytelling, not to mention some absolutely brutal finishers. This action RPG makes it fun to run around with a big sword or cleaver and clear levels while advancing through their extensive advanced class system. Unlike Final Fantasy XV, the story isn't severely lacking, though we don't spoil that here. Square has also seemed to learn from their mistakes with XV, where they seemingly kept turn-based health bars and damage output while turning it into an action RPG. I spent the majority of XV hanging from the walls with the teleport ability and spamming potions on my party because they would all die in two hits. This game was nothing like that. The majority of our playtime was spent directly in the fray facing off against foes that looked and felt incredibly powerful. You play as the mysterious Jack and can work toward and switch to any class you like, even changing as you progress the game and decide to try something else. Two out of those classes can be equipped at the same time for you to switch between as you wish in the middle of combat or otherwise, though you have to assign them at the various save points throughout the game. Your companions can advance through doing special side missions as well, and they're usually fun and challenging. Just like always though, watch out for the Tonberries. There is a multiplayer aspect of the game, though we haven't been able to try it yet. Maybe if some of our friends get the game too we will, but we don't know yet. From the description however, we can surmise you end up hosting in your playthrough and one of your friends can control one of your companions. If you've played this title, comment below what your thoughts were on the game. We hope this helps, thanks for watching, and don't forget to check out some of our other reviews here on Captain Crow Gaming.